It's a whopper of a tale. Big Fish the Musical hits the stage tonight at the Warren Consolidated Performing Arts Center. And joining me now is Nicholas Ozenberg, the technical theater teacher for the production. Nick, it's so great to have you here. Nice to have you. We are so excited to talk about this. Now, some of us have seen the movie Big Fish from back in 2003, yep. but this is Big Fish the Musical, to be clear. So tell us a little bit more about the story. For the people that haven't seen the movie, what can we expect? Well, it's a tale of Edward Bloom and his son, Will. Will, and Will is becoming a dad and his father is um, in his last stages of life and so he's trying to reconcile with his dad because they both tell stories. Will is a news reporter and Edward has always told you tall tales, fish tales. And so he's trying to figure out, Will's trying to figure out what these stories are and who, what's real, what's not. And he's trying to learn about his dad as his dad is dying and he's becoming a young dad himself. Oh, that's incredible. So how exactly do you weave the music into this? Because this is a, a completely new component. Yeah, and so they've weaved them into the stories that the dad tells mostly. But then we also have the moments where he meets his wife um, in a great song you'll hear later, as well as different songs that the son sings that gives us those internal things that are going on inside of his head, like what it means to become a dad and what that looks wow. like. So what are the underlying messages, would you say? For people? Um, the underlying messages are about the connection that fathers and sons and moms and sons have about yeah. their dad as well as what it means to be a storyteller in mm -hmm. our day and age. Mm -hmm. So this is a lot about um, you know family ties and it's something it seems uh, a lot of people will be able to relate to moms, fathers, sons, daughters, everyone. C certainly yes. Yeah so it's family friendly and um, tell us um, a little bit more about what we are going to see right now the, the actors performing this next piece here. So Kevin and Megan are two of our seniors. Kevin Kevin is from Sterling Heights High School and Megan is from Cousineau High School and they're going to sing the moment when the dad meets his wife for the very first time. Uh. They meet at a circus where she's trying to audition and so all of a sudden the song's called Time Stops. So it's that moment where you instantly no, you're going to meet the person yeah. for the rest of your life that you're going to love. Oh, how romantic is that? Okay, and tell us really quickly the details of, you know, how people can get tickets, that sort of thing. Yep, they can go to our website, which is wcskids.net backslash WCSPA, or they can buy tickets by calling 586-825-2525 and pressing 1. There you have it. All right, Nick, thank you very much. Without further ado, let's see these wonderful young people perform. And what you thought you knew changes, and life beyond this moment is better, bigger. Time stops, but still your heart is beating. Time stops, though you don't take a breath. She's there, and all you've ever wanted is nearer, clearer. I used to think the world was small. Now I don't think that way at all. Time stops when dreams come true before you. Time stops when fantasy is real. I knew this moment was expected, but this good, who could? That boy is staring and I feel chill. I don't know why that boy is staring and the world is still not tumbling by there's no one talking but i can hear a thousand voices what's going on inside me that boy is staring is it me he sees i can't be sure if he's staring should i try to please or be demure my hand is trembling but in this moment, nothing scares me. What's going on? 
I used to see what lies ahead. Now I just see this girl instead. Something more. And troubles are abandoned. Time stops the minute she arrives. I've seen the future in this instant. Subversive, sublime.